welcome back. As if Friday Cue the music decides to go off. Alrighty, let's get back to work here. We're in the middle of this ellipse. It'll be dark even during the daytime. That's what ellipse means. Um, See, so mining on this two, both of the stone cutter tables have been built. Uh, so we'll go ahead and make stone blocks. Do forever. And we'll lower the radius to there, about 34. So. And then we'll do the same thing here, make some locks, do forever, lower the radius down to 34. Now you can be deconstructed. I see John's already working on some. Meanwhile, they're trying to finish mining out the rest of, there it is. That's set up for that. Should probably put some light in the middle of the room. Wow, would probably be a good thing. Just so they can all see. One, two, three, four, yeah. Let's actually toss the light there. And then we'll need to run a power conduit down and then up. There we go. I'm going to have some light for at least a little while. Um, yeah, so nothing much going on really. Jude looks like he's going to have to be out for beaver meat. I'll try to get it all hauled to base before it goes bad. Um, use it some meals, maybe get some fine meals going for a little bit. Uh, who's my researcher? Because I think researching can be uh, Christian is. So that's that's. Send you back down and, and let you research some. Uh, research in a dark hallway. <laughs> so yeah, I should probably add a light in the hallway for them right there, shouldn't I? That way they can see in the dark. So they're probably like, why do we? Why are our hallways always so dark? I mean, we got lights in our rooms, but the door doesn't. Yeah. Um, one thing I used to love doing, and I can't do it now because um, they took it out of this build, is I would mine areas up in here, up in here, and set up a basically indoor, instead of using hydroponics, I'd use a fertilizer pump to create soil and set up an indoor farming system that way. Uh, unfortunately, they took out the uh, fertilizer pump in this build, which why I understand why is to prevent people like me from doing what I was doing. Uh, it kills my plants. So I used to never use hydroponics, which is one of the reasons why I chose an area that's year-round growing, because, yeah, I, I don't like dealing with food shortages. Uh, not, not fun. Hey, the ellipse is over. We're going to have full power again. Yay! And we almost ran out of power if you look at our bank, battery banks. We were pretty dang low. Down to about 200 in each battery. And we got down there for a second. Excuse me. Wow. But everything seems to be going okay now. And sun's going down for the night, so. Everything seems to be running okay. Everybody's doing their thing, we're fine. Got the plastic up there if I really wanted to go crazy. Got my stockpile down here. Do I not have someone repairing? First off, home region. Let's go ahead and home region up the areas I need it. And then the other thing is, I have no one repairing. I have no one repairing. Do you repair? So, because that's bothering me. <laughs> The wall is like, dive down to 17 health, I need repair. And I'm just like ignoring it because no one set up to repair. <laughs> so, that being said, we'll get to repairing it. I'm also going to go ahead and set up a whole bunch of hauling of 
the chunks and stuff that are inside the base area. Um, just so we can go ahead and get rid of them all. There we go. Uh, so they will slowly, uh oh. Uh-oh, I don't know, cool deer has gone bad. Let's see where this deer is. There it is. Be careful, it's on a psychotic rampage. Here it comes. And, uh-oh. That's a little bit more... Them. Where are they coming from? Down there. They've got a pistol, cocktail, so that's not good, and another pistol. On the bright side, they came from where the deer is, sort of, maybe. Oh dear, where there's a deer. So let's do this. Let's. Everybody up. I don't care what you're doing. Get out there, except for Christian, who's incapable of violent, and Big, who's incapable of violent. Uh, everybody else up and at them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, yeah, okay. That's all I got. Alright. Uh, I see, stay back. John, stay back. You have a shotgun. You go right there. Jude, you have your rifle. You go right there. Pig, where the hell are you going? Oh, you're hiding some wood. Alright. Um, hey, Pig, while you're at it, you want to... Um, really? Okay. Animal corpses can go in there. Are you happy now? Do me a favor. Hold a dead deer. Get him inside before the other invaders come. There we go. Alright, Jude. Fall back to here. Force them to come around the corner. Ow. Bastard. I said no. You bastard. Thank you. Alright, you! Melee attack him! You! Melee attack him! You! Fire at him! You! Scoot to there! Whatever you do, don't die. There we go. All right. All right. Before you go off, and before you go off, strip him. And the other guy can run away. I don't care. Survivor meal, you are repairing the wall. And I have everybody set for patient one. Yeah. So why don't you go ahead and rest Oh. I locked that, that's why. So who's my doctor? I believe it is Big. Treating him. And you probably treating 
food in paradise size tree and fry. There we go. So no major injuries, we survived the attack alright. Jude's already fully healed. The foggy rain outside. Battery banks are starting to grow back. Things seem to be going okay for us. We're surviving. And so it's kind of a tax, so I'm kind of I want to build this little zone here to help with um, Two. Let's, let's look and see how I want to do this real fast. Let's plan this out. Um, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. All right, let's go. One, two, three, four, five. I believe I just already put a plan there. So that's five on each side, uh, which is usually where I put my my wall. Uh, so that's going to tell me that's not going to work. So we'll have to go to 4 and 4. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4. So basically we'll kind of have a just a straight wall here. Then an entrance here with a line of turret, 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 or I might actually go like, I might actually do this, I might go the blank spot to be turrets and then wall, and a door here that comes into this area here. So in order to do that, I need to go ahead and add a There. There we go. We have more slate than anything else, so we'll go with some slate walls for there, 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 and there. Build a slate wall there, 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 and then there. Leave that gap open from that so when people come in through here, I'm actually going to want to have a secondary. Take that back. Deconstruct that, deconstruct that, deconstruct that. Cancel you. Maybe I'll set this up a little differently. I normally do. There, there. And then cancel the deconstructing again. So what I can do is have turret, 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 six turrets. And that way when they come in from here, they had to go, there's going to be, the door will be there. And this, these walls are basically more to protect those. Hey, the back picks are done. Um, mortars are brewing. Let's go to brewing so we can start turning hops into beer. Um, yeah, but once you see the final plans, this is so for the people who come up from up there. So then I want to make sure that when they enter in here, I don't want them to have an angle on that. So just that's fine, I guess. Oh, that hauled. Sandbag. Sandbag. 
this up. So that way when they come across sandbags they can't stand out they have to keep going until they get to the center area to which I'll have one two three four five turrets that was lightning and it sounded close anyway I have five turrets set up and while they're all clowning around in there My turrets will be shooting them, and I can have my guys standing back here shooting them as well uh, in this little mini area here. So, so that's the idea. We'll see how it works. Can we chop those? And then cut those, cut all the plants there. Leave the current zones that are inside that area. And then can I set up a growing zone? Is that up here? Yeah. So I want that to be no strand. That way it's all nice and ugly. <laughs> Which will make the morale go down. <laughs> and then I want to put the strongest auto door I can, which probably sandstone, ah. so sandstone it is 360, limestone is 380, slate is 345, so limestone it shall be, a limestone auto door which is going to open super freaking slowly. 45%, but that's okay. I don't really care about how slowly or quickly it opens. I'm more interested in how strong it is and how long it takes to break. That way when they come down from here, they hit this uh, bit of sandbag and they have to walk all the way through. When they come in from here, they have to go in and they'll have to hit this sandbag and go through. So, it's, it should be good. Uh, my niece is cleaning. Thank you, that actually is quite helpful. I needed someone to start cleaning pretty soon anyway. So, uh, designate your power. Designate your power. We set you to be the hall. Yeah, they've been kind of moving stuff, and when they move them out of the way of their building, it unmarks them for hauling, so. Designate that for power so we can get those, these two guys cremated. Hey, dude, can you, um, thanks. Appreciate that. Can you work on moving that out of the way? Thank you. There we go. Make sure we can those. There we go. Another turret is up. Turn it off. We got one more turret yet to be built. Last of the walls going up, and then our, our miniature kills are just complete. 
Uh, as I said, since this is on such an easy difficulty, this should actually be all we need. And we should be able to survive off this pretty, pretty easily. Um, this is going to be a pain getting in and out. Oh, oh, something happened. Cargo pods. Where? Right there. Nutrient paste meals. Uh, is this one set up to handle nutrient paste meals? Yes, it is. So, I want to, before they go bad, call them. Nutrient paste meals to the freezer as quick as possible just because you never know an eclipse or, or something like that when those might come in handy. So they're they're absolutely nasty and I'd really would rather not have to eat them. Uh, food quality is awful. Uh, but they're, they're good to have just in case. So uh, looks like we're almost pretty much done with this build. They've gotten good at building stuff lately. So. And there we go. And that's all there is to it. Turn you off. That way everything is off. Oh, look, batteries are almost full again. I guess these ones get full. I'm going to pull the plug there. And that way we've got a five battery backup there. So, um, we're looking, looking pretty good, looking like a good colony. Um, yeah. So, we will let them get to work. Uh, I see John's plugging away at blocks and stone, and farming's going along quite nicely, and then we're, we're plugging along. So, <laughs> I love brewing some. Uh, let's think there's any geothermals nearby. So let's go with gun turn cooling for right now since we just built those. The cabin over here just meandering on by. Shy stuff. It's a pessimist. Cycling goal, which has got a chemical interest. It's got a bad back. He's failing. He barely is moving. That's why he's just kind of like, yeah, I'm moving on and on. Don't mind me. Let's see if Christian gets toxic this time. Nope. Alright, we'll end it here. We'll see you guys next time. Take care.